Hi, it's Carl Kwan here. So in this video, you're going to learn how to use a picture as a PowerPoint background. And of course, this applies to people like me who use Keynote as well. Why should you do this? Well, if your slides stand out from your normal presentation slides, your presentation will stick better in the audience's mind. Like peanut butter on the roof of your mouth. So here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to show you slides from a real presentation that I fixed and added pictures for the background. I'll start by showing you the before, then I'll show you how to get from the before to the after. Let's do it! Before, boring, 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 and of course, boring. And now here's the after. First, alignment is a fast way to make a presentation more professional looking. Use a left align as your default to avoid design faults. I also changed the background color to one of their own colors to make it stand out, but it's not necessary. Second, the picture is relevant to the topic, and the size is the same or bigger than the slide. Third, the picture was in color, but it looked bad, so I made it black and white. Four, I made the title bigger to create contrast and to help the audience see better too. Number five, I took out the text box to create more openness and space. And number six, I used the black box set at 75% transparency to use as the background for the text. And if you look back at the previous slide, you'll see I used the box set at 90% transparency for the main text. This is a table, but for privacy, I removed the contents. Aside from changing the color, I used a bigger title and I lined the table's edge with the text. I had to make the table a bit smaller, but not a big deal. And I added a shadow to make the table stand out better. On this one, I did everything I've taught you, but you can see I kept the original's text boxes to save time. And I moved the text down to accommodate the picture of the kids. And on this last one, I've used the black box set at 75% transparency, a bigger title, and I've left aligned the text. The key is having the right pictures, which can be time consuming to search for, but well worth it considering the results you can achieve. So here it is again. Number one, alignment is a fast way to make a presentation more professional looking. Use a left align as your default to avoid design faults. Number two, Use pictures that are relevant to your topic. Make sure the picture size is the same or bigger than your slide size. Number three, if a picture doesn't have good colors, change it to black and white. Number four, make your titles bigger to create contrast and to help the audience see better. Number five, don't trap the text in a bordered text box. Set it free. And finally, number six, Use a black box set at 75% transparency to use as a background for your text. There you go. How to use pictures as the background for your presentation slides. If you have any questions, please leave a comment below this video and I'll talk to you again soon.